Music has always been my number one passion in life, so I knew I wanted to study music since ninth grade. When I came to uh, to Toronto, modeling was the last thing in my mind. I mean, I always I've always enjoyed looking through magazines and like seeing these dudes with like you know tall, skinny white guys with like good bone structure. I'm like I could always do that, you know, it's something <laughs> I could do. But I never thought to actually try and reach out to an agency or something like that. I always figured that was just you know something for other people to do. With music and modeling, I think they, they, they coincide together quite nicely. I'm a big fan of like performing on stage and in front of people, so it's like I sort of just drop this guard and just really like let it all out, you know? And just after doing that for so many years, it really allows you to just drop your guard when you're in front of the camera and just do whatever is necessary. You don't really able to take direction and and not be so self-conscious about it because I find a lot of people sometimes they might be too self-conscious in front of the camera and then you know the shots end up being shitty whereas if you just you know just you know you're you're working you know sometimes you're being paid to do this just you know do it right get into the persona and you know rock it I definitely think being comfortable in front of you know being comfortable uh, doing weird things. Being comfortable <laughs> doing out of the ordinary yeah. things in front of large groups of people. Yeah. Because sometimes it's awkward on set, it's not just you and a photographer all the time. Sometimes there's like, you know, like 15 people standing around the camera while you're, you know, trying to look serious doing these some photos. Other yeah, some other models, you client. know, the client, you know, just people, you know, friends of the photographer and stuff hanging around. You know, I've done shoots where there's like parties, wine, you know, food, everything going on, and you're expected to do these great shots in front of the camera and sometimes it's a little daunting. I did some acting classes in university and that sort of helps you get into a mindset of uh, nothing too intense, you know. I'm not going to say I'm a master actor or anything, but there's some like tips and stuff they give you on just being able to, you know, picture picture yourself doing what, you know, what, what needs to be done and getting yourself into certain situations and mindsets that you would normally be in in your everyday life. Mm -hmm. And sometimes you need to go to those places for, for acting to make stuff, or not, for, for modeling to make stuff work out.